Welcome to this video about supplementing calcium and alkalinity in your tank. I use Tropic Marin All for Reef and some specialized equipment, which I'll be happy to show you during this video. Unlike most other products on the market, All for Reef is a single part solution. It's sold as a liquid, but also as a powder you can mix yourself. It's much more economical to mix the powder. To help with the mixing, I have a graduated cylinder and a magnetic stirrer. A magnetic stirrer saves you a ton of time, and they're very economical to purchase. I'll put a link to one similar to this one in the description. Here's how they work. A small magnetic pill is placed inside the solution that you want to stir. The base spins the pill. To make 150 milliliters of solution, you add one level scoop and 150 milliliters of RODI water. Then it's time to start the stirrer. It can take up to 20 minutes for the stirrer to change this milky white solution into a virtually clear one. Once the solution runs clear and there is no powder suspended in the solution, it's now ready and you can add it to your reservoir. In the cabinet under my SPS tank, there is a reservoir of one and a half liters capacity and a single Chemor X1 dosing pump. I've seen some absurd pricing for dosing reservoirs. This particular one was under $30 and I'll link to it in the description. The solution leaves the reservoir, enters the pump here, and exits the pump through this line, which runs almost five feet through the back of the tank and enters one of the rear chambers of the all-in-one. The X1 doser has a mobile app that connects to your devices by Bluetooth. Using this function, you can add a fixed amount of Alpha Reef to your tank in this case, I added one milliliter. You can also automate dosing throughout the day. My SPS tank requires 33.8 milliliters per day spread out across eight different dosings. Here's what 4.4 milliliters of Alpha Reef being dispensed into the tank looks like. This maintains an alkalinity of 11 and a half which is my desired level. Every tank is different. My LPS tank requires 16 milliliters a day to stay at about eight DKA. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing to the channel and leave a comment below about how you dose your reef tank.